going on guys welcome back to my channel my name is Roxanne if it's your first time here then welcome today I want to do the book giving tag I saw this uh, tag over at the channel remembered reads I'll link um, I'll link their channel down below it was originally created by taking tea with Catherine and I will link their channel down below as well Galileo Galileo So the first question is, do you give books as gifts? If so, to whom? I do, but rarely. I don't have too many people in my life that read, uh, read especially like I read. Um, so I don't, they, they wouldn't enjoy receiving books in the same way that I would. There are some to which I sort of push books onto a little bit but they still I know really appreciate it and they are books that I have very very that I've worked very hard to find that would Galileo that would very specifically fit their tastes and things that I know they're interested in um mostly just a couple friends I my brother is big into like rock and heavy metal so I have given him like picture books on on tours that his favorite bands have been on and things like that something that he doesn't really enjoy reading um definitely not the physical books so what I give him are you know full of cool pictures and histories that I know he'll enjoy um but besides that um I give books as gifts to myself number two do you receive many books as gifts are they usually successful I have received books as gifts i wouldn't say usually mostly because a lot of people don't know what i have don't know what i've read um and they don't want to go through the trouble of like looking through goodreads or anything like that um i do have there are like two people who gift me books or have gifted me books and they've always been successful mostly just because they pay attention that much um but yeah, for the most part, people just give me gift cards, which I appreciate just as much because then I can get whatever book sort of I want at that time. Number four. Oh, number three. When you buy yourself books, do you think of them as gifts? As per what I said earlier, yes. <laughs> number four. Do you consider used books to be acceptable gifts? Yeah, I mean, I, I love books in general. So the fact that someone thought to give me a book I, I really really appreciate and especially more so if it's something like like if it's a particular edition or something like that that I that I, that they know that I really want and that I don't have and you can only buy it used then of course uh even more so I know I, th I feel like most people want to get new books or want to get you new books if they're going to get you a gift but I wouldn't be upset at the fact that someone got me a, a used book I don't really get upset at receiving gifts I, I appreciate the thought that someone had in wanting to get me anything in the first place number five if you could receive a gift card for any bookshop or book website which would you choose um re any really i mean I, I i'm trying not to buy so much real or any really on amazon so anything else um works <laughs> just it works fine i will find books that i like anywhere um what's close to me is obviously like barnes and noble but i would appreciate gift gift certificates or gift cards to to anything but i am trying to buy less on amazon if if not at all if i can if i can help it so when i ask for gift cards um if a particular bookstore or something doesn't have an, any sort of book book uh certificate gift certificate or, or gift card system then um maybe a prepaid visa or something like that with the purpose of using it in a particular bookstore would be really thoughtful as well number six gift wrapping gift bag or bear presentation i tend to probably to like gift bags because you can reuse them but if i'm if i don't have either then i will i would like something on it to sort of suggest that it is you know a sort of celebratory gift here you go um rather than a bare presentation so even if i don't have gift wrapping or a gift bag i might do like a ribbon or something like that that sort of suggests this is gift e <laughs> Number seven, can you communicate to others when a book is a lend and not a gift? 
No, because I don't do it. I don't lend gifts. Uh, I don't lend books to anybody because the times that I have, I have either never gotten them back or have gotten them back in such poor condition that I am just so livid that I'm, I've just gotten to the point where I don't lend books. And it's not really any a conversation that I need to have anyway because, like I said, I don't really have too many people in my life who read like I do, so they're not really going to ask me to borrow my books anyway. Number eight, have you ever given someone an ebook? No, I don't believe so. I don't, no, I haven't. Uh, number nine, name five books you'd love to receive as gifts. Uh, so I, I collect Pride and Prejudice editions, so any, any newer edition that I, it would be much more likely that I don't yet have, uh, would obviously be amazing. Um, I like particular editions of different books. So I'm, I started the, um, the Robin Hobb books and I actually want to reread this one before I continue on in the series, but this is the, these are the editions that I like. These are the only editions of this book that I find to be really nice. Um, and I do like, I know it's it's it might be um, you know something that's not really significant or or I can't think of the word right now like lacks meaning but the the aesthetic of it I do enjoy I, I love having books that look nice especially and I don't just buy books because they look nice I buy books that I want I want to read anyway and that I'm and that I'm I I'm very interested in and then. If there are multiple editions of those, I will get the one that I like the most. I think that's something that many, many, many of us do. So th the rest of this series in these editions, I would love. Um, I want to reread and continue on in the Mistborn. Um, I want to reread the Mistborn original trilogy and then continue on with that entire world that Sanderson has done. But I prefer those UK covers that, I think they're UK covers that, um, book depository cells. I don't know if you can get those anywhere else. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think they're, those are the ones that I can think of right now that, that would be definite, like good bets to get me as gifts. Um, but other than that, I guess any newer book that I've, that I've said, usually what, what people have done or like what one particular person has always done is that I was, we'll just go to the bookstore and then I can pick what I want and then they'll buy it for me. <laughs> so that works just as well. Um, and it also does for like a fun outing as well. So yeah, number 10, tag some book slash gift people. I don't usually tag people because I don't want to put that pressure on them. But if you saw this and like myself thought it was a fun uh, little tag to participate in, feel yourself tagged and let me know if you are planning on doing it or have done it so that I can check it out as well. As always, thank you for watching and for listening. I love you all very much.